Hi, my name is David P. Shapiro. I'm the owner and managing partner of the law office of David P. Shapiro, located in San Diego, California, where my firm helps good people regain control of their future when charged with a crime. In this video, I want to talk to you about a few tips of what to look for in a criminal attorney. Okay, one thing you're looking for is does this attorney and does this law firm, probably even more importantly, does this law firm have experience in the type of cases that I'm coming to them for help with? You know what I mean? So if you're, you know, if you're if you're charged with with a violent robbery and you know you go to the best DUI lawyer in town, that DUI lawyer may be as good as they come on on DUIs, on misdemeanors, on lower level offenses. But you want to ask that attorney, hey, how many violent offenses have you defended? You know, don't give them that, well, what's your success rate? Because that's a that's a loaded question and that's something really that's difficult to answer for a number of reasons, which I talk about in some other videos. But you want to know, hey, do you have experience handling these types of cases in this type of courthouse? Right? Same reason. My firm's located in San Diego. People come to us and they say, hey, we need a San Francisco criminal defense lawyer. You know, I've never handled a case in, in Northern California. But I know and we know who to send you to that is going to do, we believe, a real good job for you. That has that experience. That has that reputation. That will represent you the right way and get you the best outcome possible. Another factor you want to look at is ideally you want an attorney in a law firm that's got jury trial experience. Because, you know, if they if they haven't been to trial a lot and they don't have that experience, it's hard for them to assess the value of a case. You know, there may be cases that, that may not be the greatest factual case, but, you know, if you have that trial experience, you may look at it and say, well, how's it really going to get worse? Might as well fight it. Good things may happen, right, when you go to trial. Maybe another situation where, you know, a lot of attorneys may just tell the client what they want to hear, they go to trial, they lose, they're in a significantly worse position than what a deal was might have been offered to them. So you want to keep that in mind. Jury trial experience is key. What type of experience is the law firm that you're considering you know, hiring? What type of experience do they have? Another thing you want to look at is how accessible that law firm is, right? How involved are they in the community? How available are they to help you? You know, what you're looking for in a criminal defense law firm, for the most part, is a firm that has structure and has organization, right? So, you know, don't don't be insisting that the attorney that's representing you answer the call every single time you call. You know, a lot of firms, myself included, is, hey, we schedule appointments, you know, because we want to be focused on the task at hand when we're in that moment. So just like we give each individual client the attention, you know, we don't want those outside distractions. And we're more than happy to schedule a time for our attorneys to speak with our clients you know, unless it's an emergency situation, then we'll get on the phone right away. But you still want to be accessible, right? So if if I'm handling case and I'm not available, whether I'm in court or whether I'm doing a jail visit or whether I'm off for the day, you know, I know that my firm is there for our clients. They're there to answer those questions as good, if not better, in some instances than I may be able to, and faster. And one thing you also want to keep in mind is whenever you're looking at a at a private criminal defense law firm and considering whether to hire them. You know, listen, it's nice to have a good website, right? That shows you care. That shows you take pride in your work. That shows that you're on top of things. That shows that that could, in many instances, be a reflection of the type of person or the type of law firm that it is, right? But just don't get wooed by a fancy website, okay? That's something to consider, but we see far too often, you know, good people out there hiring law firms that are just not equipped and not skilled enough and don't have the commitment and to represent you the right way and you, and, you know, they come into my office and we're like, hey, why'd you hire that firm? You know, I, anyone would have told you that, that that never would have been a good match. Well, you know, I really like their website. You know, maybe that's what makes you should pick up the phone. But when you're going through that case evaluation process, in many ways, you're evaluating that law firm just like they're evaluating their, your case. You know, if you don't feel comfortable and these things don't add up, experience, accessibility, trial experience, courtroom experience in that jurisdiction... You know, you might want to make a change. You might not want to hire that law firm to begin with. So I hope this video is helpful. You know, going through some points on what to look for when hiring a criminal defense law firm. If you have any other questions about that, uh, whether your case is in San Diego or not, I would encourage you to reach out to my firm. Hopefully we can be of assistance for you. 619-916-4265.